Hello everybody, I'm Captain Joel Dickey, and we're down here in Big Pine Key, Florida. I'm a full-time captain for Bonefish, Permit, and Tarpon, and I'm here with uh, Lewis Cahill from Gink and Gasoline, and I'm going to show you three essential knots that you're going to use when you come down and fish the flats with fly. Uh, the first knot that I'm going to show you is a double figure eight loop knot. It is used to attach your fly to your tippet, and the reason I like this knot is because it is a 100% line strength knot. Uh, I also like it because it, it's a loop knot. And I use loop knots when I attach my flies because it gives the fly itself more life and more uh, movement as you strip it through the water, so therefore making a more natural presentation to the fish. Okay, to tie the double figure eight loop knot, the first thing you're going to want to do is tie a double overhand loop into your into your leader. Now, as you can tell, there's a double overhand figure uh, knot in there, and what you want to do is you want to kind of slowly cinch it down, which creates a figure eight. <clears throat> now, take the tag in go through the eye of the hook one time. Now, as you can tell, see how the tag in, you want to follow the tag in back through the figure eight that you just created. You're going to follow it through there, and then follow it back through the top half of the figure eight. just like so. Now, once you've done that, <clears throat> you have to cinch that knot down to the eye of the hook. Let me get my pliers here. And generally when I do this, on my boat I have a, a little J hook in my, in my console to help me do this. But uh, we're going to do this on the arm of this chair here. So what you do here, Take your pliers, grab your tag in. This is your leader. Now the leader tightens the knot. The tag in cinches the knot down to the eye of the hook. So you kind of want to kind of work it down and pull it simultaneously. All right. Now, once you've done that, here's the second part of the knot. Essentially, what you got is just basically you're going to loop your tag end over. And go around both the loop and the leader once, twice, okay, and kind of cinch it up just a little bit so it doesn't go loose again. Now here's this, <clears throat> the other part you got to tighten that down. So I'm going to grab the tag in with my pliers. Now this time, the tag in cinches the loop and the leader part jams it against the other knot. And once you just pull that real nice and tight, and there is your loop knot to attach your fly. Just clip the ends here. Just like so.